Uh, today we're going to be reviewing all three uh, Villainous expansions. Um, there's a red one, a purple one, and a brown one. This one is Perfectly Wretched. This one is Wicked to the Core. And this one is Evil Come Prepared. So, um, and these ones you don't need to play with the base game. Um, you can play standalone if you want. So, let's get started. Uh, this is Dr. Facilier, and his objective is control the talisman and successfully rule New Orleans. Both of those cards are in this pile. Um, his locations are the Voodoo Emporium, the Parade, Tiana's Place, and the Bayou. He is from Princess and the Frog. This is Hayden. Um, his objective is to start your turn with three titans at non-Olympus. Um, the titans are in this deck. His locations are the underworld, the Thebes, the gardens, and Mount Olympus. He is from the movie Hercules. This is Evil Queen. Um, her objective is to defeat Snow White. Um, so you'll notice it says poison and ingredients. Um, she has a couple of ingredients located in, in this deck, and they will go here. Poison is power turned into poison. It goes here. Her locations are the laboratory, the woods, the mine, and the Dwarves Cottage, which is locked at the beginning of the game. Um, and she is from Snow White. These are the characters from Perfectly Wretched, starting with Corella de Ville. Um, her objective is to start her turn with at least 99 captured puppies. Um, her, her puppies are right here. Um, this is the back. Um, and her locations are Radcliffe House, Countryside, Milk Farm, and Hell Hall. She is from 101 Dalmatians. The second character in Perfectly Wretched is Mother Gothel. Her objective is to start your turn with at least 10 trust. So trust is power that was converted into trust. And that goes here. So she actually starts with Rapunzel at Rapunzel's tower. And you can defeat her, but she never leaves. Um, her locations are Rapunzel's tower, the snuggly duckling, the forest, and Corona. She's from the movie Tangled. Uh, this is Pete. He is the last character in Perfectly Wretched. Um, his goal is to complete the four goals selected. Um, these are his goals. You choose four of them randomly. And they look like this on the other side. So his locations are Frontier Town, Service Station, the airport, and Podunk Landing. Um, he is from a TV show long ago. I do not know what it's called. And as you can see, everything's black and white, even his cards. And his fake cards are also black and white. Um, our first villain in Evil Comes Prepared is Radigan. Radigan's objective is to place Radigan's objective tile here. So that means this is his objective tile. The reason it's an objective tile is because there's two sides. So his actual objective is to start your turn with the Robot Queen at Buckingham Palace. So the Robot Queen is in this deck and she does cost 15 power. 
His locations are The Secret Lair, Laversham's Toy Shop, Big Ben, and Buckingham Palace. He is from Great Mouse Detective. Um, this is Yzma. Um, her objective is defeat Cusco using Kronk. Cusco is in one of these fate piles. She has a spe special setup with her fate decks. Um, you put four fate decks in a pile at each location, like this. So Cusco could be in any of these, and she needs Kronk to defeat him. Um, her locations are the palace, Pacha's house, the jungle, and Mudka's meat hut. She is from the movie Emperor's New Groove. This is the last villain in Evil Comes Prepared and the last villain we're going to review today. He is Scar. Scar's objective is to start your turn with at least 15 strength in the succession pile. So the succession pile goes right here. And what it means by strength is the strength of heroes. Um, his locations are Pride Rock, the Savannah, Elephant Graveyard, and the Gorge. He is from the movie Lion King. And to mention again, you do not need this game to play these. You can play this one without this. They all come with their own power, and so that is um, all the villainous characters. Keep playing and have fun.